Hey guys, what's up? Something, this is basically a phenomenon. The Limitless came with the 34 tooth spur that definitely did not reach my 20 tooth pinion. Doing some math, doing research, looking at questions and answers on an old forum about the same situation from 2020. Now we know that the felony comes with the 46 spur and a 16 pinion and that meshes, that meets. And that is a 62 tooth total between both gears. And these are modular in increments of uh, one millimeter. So if you re take away one tooth from here, you're taking away a millimeter. If you add it here, it should still mesh. It's the same, it's the same um, volume and combined diameters. Now, this is as far in as this could go, and this is a 42. It's only four teeth less than a 46, which is what comes stock on this platform. And it looks as if, this is a 42, it looks like if I had a 46, it still wouldn't reach. Because that is more than four millimeters apart. And you're talking about from the tip of the tooth on the spur to the deepest part between the teeth on the pinion. That is more than 42, that is more than four millimeters from a 42 tooth to a 46. That is more than a four millimeter gap. So if I was to actually have a 46 tooth spur in here, it still wouldn't reach a 20, but the, um, the V1 infraction came with a 17, and then the V2 came with a 16 tooth pinion. This is very weird. It looks like I would have to have like a 26 tooth pinion to get this to just barely mesh. That's six more teeth. Can you imagine a from a 16 to a 26? That's 10 more teeth and going down four teeth on your spur from a 46, that is that is a very huge climb in, in uh, miles per hour. If I, all I have left that will fit from my stock is I have a 35 and then I have a 30 on my Creighton. So I'd have to drop this 35 on there and put a 30 on here. And I don't wanna go I don't want to go taller than a 42 because I can't have this coming that close to the top because I can't use this lid with this. I have to buy the V2 lid because this hump here is hitting this portion. So I'm about to go into the garage and, and um, do some more fabricating. I fabricated this and I grinded it flat and block sanded it smooth so that this can come down and bolt down to it. But look, this is hitting. So I'm gonna go into the garage and I'm gonna cut this out. I'm gonna grind this flat for the meantime. And this has the bearing carriers that holds this secured. So once, whether I grind this flat or whatever the case, you know, that's a, that's a different subject. I just can't have a larger spur because if this comes flush to this is going to be scraping the lid for the v for the v2 motor mount that's going to be going on here whether it's factory or aftermarket it's going to give me the same problem so i can't go any larger than 42 and this 20 tooth pinion doesn't fit that is bizarre man that is bizarre my only guess is that maybe on the stock Spectre motors that come on here, having a five millimeter shaft instead of an eight, they have the advantage of bolting it slightly off center to where it's actually slightly in more to give them the advantage of gearing it down low enough so that, you know, consumers can, you know, drive it aggressively and not overheat, which is why they went, they uh, went from 17 tooth to 16 on the pinion on the V2 because they were overheating. So that could have been a, a feature. The motors could have had their um, screw mounting holes, you know, cattywampa so they can just off-center it. But what do you guys know?
riding a um i forgot how the castle motor bolted up on the felony i haven't worked on that car in, in a long time but you know running these tps at these motors they bolt up directly centered and now you know it looks like i can run this 35 and this would only be like about right there in the middle running a 35 so that is wild man i want you guys you know have any experience with this you get you know you you get the deal you know i want to stay as close to 20 if possible i don't want to go out and buy a 25 and it's still you know it barely meshes i'd rather just run a 30 and save my money so you guys can help me out i would greatly appreciate that you guys have a good day